Kids, we are going on a trip. Hooray! <laughs> Hit and Penny are going on vacation. Hurry up, Daddy. The airplane will leave soon. What are you going to do on the plane, Pit? I'm gonna listen to my music for the whole flight! This is the flight attendant, and she has an announcement. Hello, dear passengers. Please listen to the safety rules. Pit? Pit? Oh no, Pit's music is too loud. <coughs> Why not tap him on the shoulder? Huh? Pit, you need to listen to the safety rules. Okay, I'm sorry. It's okay. Pit is ready to listen. Please fasten your seatbelts. It is now safe for the airplane to take off. Whee! This sign means you must stay in your seat. <laughs> that cloud looks like a castle. Oh. Penny, you've forgotten the safety rules. Oh, Penny, you can't move right now. Look at this sign. You must stay in your seat when it's on. Good. Pit really needs to use the bathroom. Hold on, Pit. Okay, Pit. Yes. You can now leave your seat. But watch for others. Run in the airplane. Do you understand me? Yes, mommy. Okay, here you go. Time to put your seatbelts back on. Yes, Mr. Potato, that means you too. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Thank you, sir. Huh? What are Pit and Penny up to now? <laughs> Wake up, Mommy! Huh? What? They are being too loud. Oh. Kids, be quiet! Oops! We're sorry! Penny returns to her seat. And Pit buckles up his seatbelt. There we go. And now the flight is over. <laughs> Bye, Pit and Penny and Mommy and Daddy. Have a nice trip. Pit yeah. and Penny are waiting for the bus. Oh look, here comes the bus now. Pit butts in front of everyone. Huh? Miss Tomato isn't very happy. Huh? Oh. Pit, you should stay in line. Uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> it is always best to wait your turn. There are lots of places to sit. Pit thinks they should play a game. Penny wants to play too. But you should always stay in your seat on the bus. Or you could get hurt. Thank you, Miss Tomato. Kids, don't run in a bus. It's not safe. Uh... Okay. <laughs> now more people are getting on the bus. That man has a broken leg. <laughs> Thank you, young man. Well done, Pit. <laughs> Pit, someone else needs a seat. Pit! 
Whoops! I'm sorry! <laughs> Here you go, Mrs. Lettuce. <laughs> Shh! Mrs. Lettuce is sleeping. Penny wants to watch some funny videos. But the noise has woken up Mrs. Lettuce. Penny, it's too loud! You'll disturb other passengers. Huh? Okay, I'm sorry. Penny, just use your earphones. Ah, peace and quiet. Have a nice nap, Mrs. Lettuce. Hmm. This passenger looks suspicious. Oh no! Mrs. Lettuce left her purse on the floor. Someone should stop him! Huh? He's a thief! Pit has saved the day! Thank you, young man. Well done, son! Today is a very special day at school for Pit and Penny and their friends. Miss Apple has brought in a surprise guest. Children, this is an officer. Today, he will teach you safety rules. Mm -hmm. The whole class is excited to meet a real policeman. Go ahead, officer. <clears throat> this stranger in the picture wants to break into your house. Even Miss Apple is scared. Oh no! Mr. Lemon is sneaking outside of Pitt and Penny's house. Ah. <laughs> what does he see when he peeks through the window? <laughs> Pitt and Penny are home alone, playing poppets. <laughs> Mr. Lemon is up to no good. <laughs> There's someone at the door. What should you do? At first, Pitt and Penny are scared. And Mr. Lemon has a sneaky plan. <laughs> Hey, kids, I have a bunch of lollipops for you. Pit loves candy, but Penny knows it's a trick. No! Well, Pit, Pit would rather have a lollipop. And he lets Mr. Lemon in. Run, Pit, run and hide. Phew, Penny is safe under a table. <laughs> Don't trust strangers who want to give you something. Do you children understand? Good. What should you do? Huh? The children think and think, and Lime has an idea. We should talk to a stranger through the door. <laughs> but Officer Pepper thinks that's a bad idea. We should open the door and attack him. That's an even worse idea, Pear. Penny knows what to do. We need to call the police. Well done, Penny. <laughs> Pit is still being chased, but that box won't stop Mr. Lemon for long. You're not safe yet, Pit. Call 911 immediately if an intruder breaks into your house. Remember what Officer Pepper said? Call 911. Penny calls for help. Good thing Officer Pepper is on the job. He'll know what to do. Oh, is someone trying to break into your house? I'll be right there. Officer Pepper hops into the police car and rushes to the rescue. <laughs> Under the bed is a great place to hide. Uh, oh. <laughs> Can he find Pit in the dark? The flashing lights mean Officer Pepper has arrived. <laughs> Mr. Lemon picked the wrong house tonight. And we'll now be going to jail. Bye bye, Mr. Lemon. Pit and Penny get a reward lollipops. And a reminder. Don't open the door to strangers. You need to call the police immediately. Oh, I don't think they'll forget. Thank you, officer. Now we know how to deal with intruders. All the children cheer. Take a bow, Officer Pepper. But later that night. Pit and Penny are home alone. <laughs> oh no, who's at the door this time? Should they call the police? Nope, it's only Mommy. Just in time for lots and lots of hugs. 
Bye. <laughs>